Well, the trees are back. See this little new tree right here? And there's another tree down there. Down this tire block. All new trees. You know, back in uh, 85, 86, there used to be trees here. And they had to cut them down because the low life egg sucking bottom feeders that hang out here on the street. And what I mean by that is was the, the heroin addicts, prostitutes, oh yeah, and the drunks. Yep. Yeah, this old place was an embarrassment, man. It's our town. There used to be a, a long apartment building in this field. And, uh, and those were the kind of people who were living here. So, I'll tell you one thing the city of Lake also needs to do stop the apartment building. Okay, like I said, there's a lot of heroin addicts, prostitutes, drunks, cocaine freaks. It's all on this block. Decent people couldn't even walk around this neighborhood. Because they tried walking around this neighborhood, the cops were accusing them either. Uh, uh, being drunk or something, you know. When he's good in this field, that old pine tree. There's one old house over here. That used to be a second-hand store. I think the church used to own it. They'd run a second-hand store. I guess that old place is up for sale. Right there. Probably one of the oldest places on the block. Yeah. Yeah, across the street from the old post office. Yep, they closed it down. Yep. And fenced up the old parking lot. Yeah, and here, it's, this is all new. I can't remember what year they built it. Maybe the late 90s, early 2000s. Yeah. Just be like four or five apartments in a row. Well, Big Merle would come down here and see his grandkid. Yep. It's a shame they put a fence around that old house. They always been nice. You know, and they put that up. To me, fences ruin the neighborhood. And like I said, we don't need no more apartments in Elsinore. So, anyways. There's the old fire department. I think it's 10. Yep, it is 10. A friend of mine used to work there. I can't remember his name. Just before the 1980 flood. TT or phone company building way down there. 
across from that old last house down there. I don't know what to use it for anymore. At least the mountains look good. Yeah, I'll show you guys something. You know, it's here or this one. I mean, I don't know why the city has not done anything about it. They've always been good at yelling at people, cut your weeds. They get cold enforcement, give them a ticket. I mean, who are all these departments right here? It wouldn't hurt them hurt to come out here and cut this down. <clears throat> that, that's that fire plant. Cold weather it turns bright red. I think that's what that is. Uh, they don't want to get that juice on you and cause you to break out. Or if it gets you in your eye, you're really in the need going to the doctor. Yeah, yeah, it is the fire plant. And it looks like that. All right. Yeah, you get that juice on you. It could be bad for you. Look at this, man. It wasn't that bad in the 80s. But this old house. All the old prostitutes would hang out down there. I'll come to the city out and tore that down. I think it's been that way since the 80s. What an embarrassment. And all the weeds. They go around giving people tickets. I would think the alley would be their responsibility. In the 80s, man, there was all kinds of street trash on the street. Bunch of old drunks. Thieves. Oh, man. They say, they say this wasn't the 1980s still. You lived in one of these apartments. You'd go out and you'd do your shopping, come back home. A neighbor done broke in your house, stole what, what they could. Happened to me two times in this town. But total, but my house been also been totally been broken into three times in, in Lake Elsinore. The only city I lived in ever happened to. And it always involved the neighbors wanted doing it. Okay. Anyhow. I thought that you know they put in new trees and the reason why they cut the trees down in the first place was all the all the scum that, that walked up and down the street. There'd be a prostitute standing by every tree. And so they cut them down to make more visibility. It used to be nice because it had shade here in the morning and stuff. Alright. Yeah, as I show you, the trees they cut back, they cut down around 85. They planted them back. Yeah, Lake Elsinore. Don't let them build any more apartments in your city because all they're inviting is uh, more bad people. You know? Used to be a good guy. He's walking down the street named Merle, Big Merle, nicest gentleman you can beat, meet. And it's a shame what happened to him. He was the very nicest guy you could ever meet. 